Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for May 19th of 2023. Well, it is titled Curly Spiral Galaxy M63. So what do we see here? Well, this is the spiral galaxy known by its catalog designation of Messier 63, also known as NGC 5055, and is a spiral galaxy about the size of our own Milky Way, about 100,000 light years across. It's also known by the common name of the Sunflower Galaxy. Now, this very deep exposure brings out a lot of detail in it and we can see how curled these spiral arms are here. So it doesn't seem like an ordinary spiral galaxy where we see majestic spiral arms swirling in nice unison around the galaxy. Here we see them stretching out almost twice the distance almost twice the size of the galaxy out into the distance. Now what they are are what we call star streams. These are streams of material or leftover bits of other galaxies that are being consumed by the larger galaxy. Each galaxy has small satellite galaxies that orbit it much as our own Milky Way does. And those galaxies sometimes pass too close and become tidally disrupted torn apart by the gravitational force of the galaxy itself. And those are the streams that we're seeing they are the parts of a galaxy left over as they are torn apart. Now, in the long run, this will eventually incorporate it. This material will become incorporated into the larger galaxy and everything will settle down. So if we could come back in a billion years or so and look at this galaxy, it might look like a perfectly ordinary galaxy. It's just gained a little bit of material over time from these smaller galaxies that orbit it. Now, this is how we believe galaxies evolve over time, how they have changed from the very small galaxies that existed early in the history of the universe to the very large spiral and elliptical galaxies that we see today. And the galaxies do this through cannibalization of other galaxies. The cannibalization generally refers to smaller galaxies being consumed by a larger one. You can also have larger galaxies that collide and then merge together to form even larger galaxies. So in this way, galaxies continue to grow over time. Although we do find that the intensity of the collisions, the number of collisions has decreased. They were very common in the early history of the universe and are much less common today. So that was our picture of the day for May 19th of 2023. It was titled Curly Spiral Galaxy M63. We'll be back again next time for the next picture previewed to be Galileo's Europa. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.